Before wasting your time we are going to share top 5 best bike pump. Number 3 on the list is Top Eat Joblo 2B2 STAGE. The 2B2 stage pump incorporates a knurled knob to remove a pre staw valve core so that you can get more air into a tubeless tire more quickly, promoting seating. That's stage 1. You can then refit the core and flip a switch to get things up to operating pressure using stage 2. There's an adapter if you want to pump Schrader valve tubes. The system works well, but we did find that the overall number of strokes needed to inflate a tire was a bit longer than with a standard pump. Number 2 on the list is Lezine Digital Road Drive Mini Pump. A digital gauge on this mini pump from Lezine will give you accurate tire pressure measurements to a realistic and achievable maximum inflation capacity of 90 psi out in the middle of nowhere. On test we found that the hard-wearing aluminium pump was swift and efficient at reaching desired size, more than just get you home levels, and cross-checked with a regular gauge, actually really accurate. ITS length and weight are heavier than some of the other bike pumps, especially when compared to the likes of the iPump Twist Mini Pump or Topic Micro Rocket Al Mini Pump but it can still easily fit in a jersey pocket. Just watch for losing sight of the dust cap. It is a great bike pump for several reasons, but if the price is putting you off, it's worth bearing in mind that it can potentially save you the additional outlay of having to purchase a pressure gauge, assuming of course that you are not wanting to seek size over the maximum volume. Number 1 on the list is Topic Micro Rocket Al Mini Pump. A light aluminium construction, this pump is connected directly to the valve without the need for any assembly or an extra hose. AT just 160 mm long and weighing only 65 grams, it is one of the smallest bike pumps on the market and easy to fit in a jersey pocket or even a saddle bag. If you are already packed to the rafters, the mini pump even comes with a frame mounting kit for either side of the bottle cage or an optional extra centerline mount, although check the brackets fit on your tubing shape before investing. The claimed 160 psi seems slightly keen, as on test 200 strokes only got us to just above 60 psi on a 23mm tire. It's more than enough to get you home or back to race HQ but not as impressive as the Lezine Carbon Drive Light Mini Pump, although to be fair it was comfortable in the hands when using.